What we've been about is trying to understand behavior because behavior is what everything does. From microbes to humans, we all behave. And understanding how behavior works is critical then to understanding how to work within systems. This group here, every time they ate straw, over a couple week period received a nutrient infusion of, a new, of energy in this case here. We, they were mildly deficient in energy. This group here just got water. You can see the difference in their liking for the straw. One group loves it, the other group's not interested at all. And it's all a function of feedback. Behave is about innovation. That's absolutely what we're about. Bringing together the most innovative people in science with the most innovative people in practice to feed off of one another, to continually push the bounds of what's known, to move us into the unknown, to continually create the future, and out of that, to create new practices. The people trained by BEHAVE and the science management concepts are now being implemented around the world, but BEHAVE is at a branching point. Nothing stays the same. For BEHAVE to grow and develop and continue to evolve, we're going to have to ramp it up to a whole other scale. That's the key point that I, I'm getting at here. And it's got to be, in my mind, about linkages. Linking our health with the health of soil, plant, people, animal, and people. And that health means including holistic veterinary practices, holistic practices in medicine. It's not just about agriculture. It's about systems, entire systems, and our health, and what it means for that to be health.